I'm going to make um, delicata in another way. So my go-to way is usually fries, which I love, but I'm gonna make these as mashed potatoes. Potatoes. And we're gonna see, because delicata has a texture very similar to potato when it's cooked, obviously when it's cooked. And I think it's gonna make a delightful loaded baked potato type, not baked potato, but a loaded potato feel. The hardest part about this is peeling. And you know, I've said it before in videos, but if you're just roasting your delicata, you don't need to peel it. But I wanna mash it. So because I'm going to mash it, I don't want any peel in there, it'd be weird. The hardest part about delicata is if you're mashing it, the rest of it is easy to work with, but mashing it is not so simple. I mean, jeepers. I'm so good at making videos. I can do this without chopping a finger. It's doable, right? All right. Scoop out the guts. I think you could roast this with the guts in. I have never tried it, but I think you could roast it with the guts and then the guts would scoop really easy. Have you ever tried that? If you've tried that with pumpkin or any other squash that has seeds in it, let me know in the comments. I'd love to know if that is something you can do. I don't know, why not? I'm just gonna roast your seeds, right? I don't know. Try it, KJ. What's the worst that could happen? Okay. Watching me scoop the squash guts out makes for interesting television. So the way I, whoops, I missed a seed. The way I like to cook my root vegetables, um, I like to roast them at times, but if I'm cooking anything to prepare for mashing, I say root vegetables, but I really mean any vegetable that I wanna mash, cauliflower, potato, sweet potato, anything like that, I steam it. It steams quickly, it seems to just, I don't know, I like the texture of steamed vegetables when I mash them. It seems to put the right amount of moisture in it without overdoing it, and I like it that way. So I'm going to use my double-decker steamer to steam these, and really they'll probably only take maybe 12 minutes worth of steaming. Steaming seems to be a relatively quick method for cooking veggies. All right, so my, I have a double-decker steamer. I'm gonna put the delicata on the bottom and then I'll be adding uh, russets to the top. I'm gonna kind of move this to the side and I'm gonna have russets on the top for the family. So here we go, I'm gonna get that started and let that steam and we'll come back and we'll take a look and see how they look. We'll take a look and see how they look. That sounds professional. We'll be back. Okay, so I've finished steaming my delicata. It is perfectly tender, perfectly beautifully tender. It took about maybe 10 minutes or so, not bad. And I am going to treat these just like I would a potato, just like I would like a russet if I was making a whipped potato for Christmas or Thanksgiving or Saturday. All right, there's a little splash of milk, some butter, a couple tablespoons. I'm not eating this whole delicata. I don't need the entire squash. Delicata is a fuel pull, but it's a squash. So it's a little more carby um, than say a green bean would be 
but it's way less carby than other um, like sweet potato or other winter squashes. It's lower in carbs than the rest. So it works well in a fuel pull, but you don't want to eat three cups of it. And let's be mindful. All right, I'm gonna whip it just like if I was making whipped potatoes. Make, I don't know if y'all whip potatoes. I like to make whipped potatoes at Christmas time and Saturday. The fam still eats them. All right, see how easy that whips? Look, okay, look you guys. Tell me, that doesn't have the texture of mashed potato. It's so good. It has, it's more of a squashy flavor than potato, obviously, because it's squash, but it's not that, you know, like acorn squash is that like super squashy, I don't even know how to describe it, flavor. This is not like that. This is more potatoey than it is squashy. But the texture, I mean, I wish you could really feel it and see. It's very potato-like. It's so good. Mmm. Mmm! Ma'am! Maybe I will eat the whole thing. I want a very big squash. Top that with a little sour cream some bacon crumble and you have an awesome side that is just like potato for your roasted chicken like I have in the oven. So, okay, I just wanted to show you real quick how versatile and how amazing, you can also fry this up like hash, fry it up in butter. I'm gonna do that another day this week. Fantastic, fantastic vegetable. So check out Delicata while it's in season, get as many as you can and eat as many as you can right now. Okay guys, have a good night.